Hey everyone, this is Nate from Get VoIP, and today we're talking about PBX phone systems. Let's get right to it. A PBX, short for Private Branch Exchange, is a local telephone network that manages all of a business's internal and external voice calls. Because the PBX is exclusive to the business using it, all internal communications between in-network users and devices is free. PBX helps companies avoid purchasing additional phone lines from third-party telecommunications providers, allowing them to add in-network PBX extensions and phone numbers instead. While VoIP isn't the same thing as PBX, PBX phone systems give businesses access to advanced VoIP features unavailable on traditional PSTN phones. This includes things like visual voicemail, IVR, call queuing, and even additional communication channels. PBX connects, switches, and routes business calls to their destinations effectively, but how it does that depends on which of the four types of PBX phone systems you choose. Analog PBX is a traditional on-site phone system operating via the wired PSTN. The business using it, not the telephone network provider, is responsible for installing, maintaining, and monitoring it. It offers limited features and requires lots of expensive and bulky equipment which is why analog PBX will be obsolete within the next decade. On-premise PBX, like an analog system, is hosted on-site and managed by the end user and not the provider. Unlike analog phones, on-premise PBX is powered by VoIP, using IP PBX to facilitate virtual calling. Because on-premise PBX requires businesses to purchase their own hardware and have an in-house IT team, it's a cost prohibitive option for many businesses. Hosted PBX, also called cloud or virtual PBX, is a VoIP powered phone system hosted and maintained by the third party provider off site in the cloud. Cloud PBX is popular for the cost savings, mobility, and scalability it offers, not to mention the advanced VoIP features. Hybrid PBX is a combination of traditional PBX and VoIP using SIP trunking to create a virtual link between existing on-site PBX equipment, the PSTN, and VoIP networks. However, end users, not SIP trunk providers, must still purchase and maintain their own in-house phone system. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to like it, share it, and subscribe to our channel to keep up with our journey to simplify the VoIP world. Till next time, this is Nate from GetVoIP.